Um, so this trial uh, was a three-arm trial. It, uh, the control arm was the extreme regimen, and it was the two experimental arms were uh, pembrolizumab monotherapy, and the other uh, was a combination arm of chemotherapy, platinum uh, uh, 5-FU with uh, pembrolizumab. Uh, the patient population uh, was, as you'd expect, for, a pa for recurrent metastatic head and neck cancer, but there were about 80% HPV negative, 20% were uh, P P16 uh, positive. And an important aspect of, the, of this study was analysis based on pdl one expression. And pdl one expression was determined by what was called the combined positive score, which takes into account immune cells and uh, also uh, tumour cells. So. The primary endpoints were overall survival and progression-free survival, and they were looked at in three uh, populations. The patients that had a combined positive score greater than 20, greater than 1, and in the, in the total population. So first of all, if we look at the results with uh, pembrolizumab monotherapy compared to uh, extreme, it significantly improved overall survival compared to the extreme regimen in the patients with pd one expression of CPS greater than 20 and greater than 1. Uh, we've demonstrated that it was non-inferior in the total population, uh, but we, we weren't, it, it did not meet the superiority uh, thre uh, threshold. Uh, there was no significant differences seen in, uh, uh, in no improvements seen in progression-free survi survival. And response rates, although lower with monotherapy, were substantially longer. And the, so the adverse event profile was favourable with less uh, serious adverse events uh, in, the, in patients that received pembrolizumab uh, monotherapy. So now turning to the pembrolizumab and chemotherapy combination uh, compared to the extreme regimen. So this, the pembrolizumab containing uh, combination with chemotherapy also improved overall survival. It improved overall survival in all three populations. If you do patients with uh, pd one CPS greater than 20, greater than one, and in, in the uh, total population. Um, the, the response rates were, were similar between, uh, between the two regimens. Um, there was again there was no significant difference in uh, uh, progression free survival and the adverse event prof uh, burden uh, was similar with a similar uh, percentage of toxicities and discontinuations due, due to uh, adverse uh, adverse events